Hello everybody, this is Ali Reza. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Kian.Smart Home. In this video, I'll pair Z-Wave Plus Wall Reader from Etherpass to Fibaro HCL. Stay with me to see how to pair these two devices together and see how this Z-Wave keypad works in Fibaro HCL. By the way, if you haven't subscribed my channel yet, please click the subscribe button. And at the end, if you find this video informative, do not forget to click like button. Thank you. Let's start adding the keypad to Fibaro Home Center. Before starting inclusion, resetting the keypad to factory default is essential. On keypad, we have a yellow and black wire by connecting them to each other and keeping them connected together till you hear D sound the keypad is reset to factory default now it's ready to be added to Z-Wave network in Fibaro I go to devices section select add or remove into add the lock section I increase the duration to 60 seconds then I click on add Fibaro enters into learning mode by entering the wall reader to learning mode it will be added to Fibaro home center how let's do it yellow and black wire must be connected together for a short time then master pin code which is by default one two three four five six must be entered confirming it by touching enter then by selecting zero wall reader enters into inclusion mode Wall reader is added to Fibaro Home Center. Let's go to devices. By default, it is locked. Using Fibaro, you can unlock it. If you unlock it using Fibaro app, the wall reader won't lock itself. You have to lock it manually. But if you unlock it using the keypad, after a while, it locks itself. You can see that you have the real status of keypad on Fever. Let's add pin code using Fever Home Center. I click on range enters the setting of keypad then select advance in synchronization se section i click on start synchronize now we can add pin codes to keypad in pin section I enter the new pin code in label section I set a name for it for example Alibus then click on add new pin code is added to the wall reader do not pay attention to this error just click on save okay let's test it i entered one four two five three six it's working the idea of the default admin password is zero but as soon as i added a pin code which its id is one the default pin code admin pin code won't 
work anymore. Let's add another pin code in a pin section. By the way, pin codes can be from four to six digits. I entered a new pin code, which is 695847. Then set a name for it. Click on add. We skip the error, then click on save. Second pin code is added. Let's test it. It's working. Here you can see that the Fibaro shows which user ID is used. Unlocked by user one, unlocked by user two. I unlock it by user one. Here it shows it. Let's unlock it by using user two. Let's add pin code using the keypad itself. For adding pin code using the keypad, yellow and black must be connected to each other for a short time until you hear this sound. Then admin pin code, which its ID is one must be inserted, then ENT. Now I select one, then select the ID of new pin code. I select six, then select enter. Now in, you have to enter the new pin code. Then you have to re-enter it. it. New pin code, which is 654987, is added. Fibaro immediately added the pin code in its list. The ID is 6, label is unknown. Let's test it. unlocked by user 6. The pin codes must be 4 to 6 digits. While entering the new pin code, if the pin code is less than 6 digits, you have to enter or select ENT. Here the new pin code which I added using the keypad is unknown. By clicking on the edit, I can set a name for it. For example, Sarah, save. You can easily change the pin codes. For example, I change the pin code of Alex by clicking on edit in front of it, then enter the new pin code in pin section. Three, two, one, six, five, four. Then save. When it gets to adding card, you can unlock the keypad using cards. You cannot add cards using Fibar Home Center. You have to use the keypad. Let's add this card to keypad. I select the yellow, I connect yellow and black wire together. Then enter admin pin code. Select one. Enter the ID of the new user. Select eight, then swipe the card two times. You can see that the ID number of eight is added to the list of pin codes in Fibar. Its label is unknown. It's working unlocked by user 8. 
you can change the label in Fibaro and set a name for it. Labels are not that much useful using Fibaro Home Center, but they can remind you which ID is related to whom. In the list of pin codes, by clicking on delete in front of each pin code, you can easily delete the pin code. It's not working. If you enter several times, if you enter several times wrong pin code, the keypad locks for a short time. Let's see what scenes you can have using this wall reader. I select add scene, select magic. Selecting the device, I select the keypad, then next. Battery less than is somehow useless as it needs constant power. You can trigger scenes based on manual unlock, manual lock, lock from keypad, pin entered by let's select it you can select which user for example Ali Reza I selected Ali Reza then click next what happens okay the scene is that as soon as Ali Reza unlock or enter his, his pin code a notification is sent to the admin let's test the scene scene triggered unlocked by user one i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have any question do not hesitate to leave comments Bye-bye.